Hey Gemini, it's Goddess Puff and welcome to your reading. Alrighty, let's see for Gemini. What is going on with my Geminis? What does Gemini need to know? Dang, there we go. I feel like I should give you one more shuffle because I was a mess. All right. We have glove, money, status, complacency, teacup, ease, rest, small mind. You could be overthinking. I just, I just felt a feeling of distraction when I first started. Knife, intention, conflict, resolution, overall energy is book, hope, ignorance, revelation. So Spirit's telling you that regardless of what's going on right now, you need to um, just not play dumb, but not care. It's telling you to have a small mind about this. It's telling you to relax and rest. If you're, money about, uh, if you're worried about money, don't. You have nothing to worry about. If you're worried about stat, your status, no need to worry about that either. Take that as it resonates. Over on you being book, hope, ignorance, revelation. I'm getting books and money. Yeah, you don't need to worry about that. Also, just honestly play dumb. Feign ignorance because I feel like someone is intentionally trying to cause conflict. And if you feed into it, they'll increase it. If you ignore it, they'll try to resolve it. I know that's annoying. And I know people playing games is annoying. But if you, again, if you feed into it, it will increase. If you ignore it or play dumb. I feel like if you play dumb to the point where you literally just stop caring or noticing at all, this person will be begging for forgiveness or trying to be friends with you. I feel like, let me get into the tarot <laughs> for Gemini. message for Gemini just play dumb to the point where it's funny to you like you just don't even I don't know why but I just feel like if you play dumb long enough you will literally see the entire thing as a joke <laughs> and you'll drop it like forever <laughs> and this person will spend their time trying to figure you out we have the Three of Pentacles, the Emperor Aries, the Hierophant Taurus, and the Ace of Pentacles. So work, work, work. Over on G is the Knight of Pentacles. You've been working your ass off. You may own your own business or be working for a, a high position at your job if you don't already have one. I see your, yeah, your money's going up. This is crazy. I'm seeing you... Um, elevate to a boss position so you could be starting your own business or working with the CEOs the bosses working with them to put you in a CEO and boss like position with the ace of pentacles I see a pay increase a status increase wow okay yeah over orange your hard work's paying off I'm seeing like a literal um what is it called the chart, the stock's going up or whatever. I'm seeing your money increase, your status increase. Everything is going up. Let me write that down. So again, if you are worried about money, there is no need to. Everything's going up. So better job, your job's going up, your position's going up, your money's going up. The people like the higher ups want to work with you. This emperor, this Aries wants to hire you, promote you, put you in a high position. Everything's going up. So you are going to get um, a promotion, a pay increase, a raise. Clarify this message, Gemini. Clarify this message. For Gemini. That's why I was telling you to feign ignorance. Just keep working. Don't act like you already have the position. Because with the over energy, it's the Knight of Pentacles. This is your hard work paying off. So even if you think you've impressed someone, keep working. Like you, like you just started the job. Don't walk around like you own the place, pretty much. Clarifying the Three of Pentacles is the Ace of Pentacles again. 
in the Knight of Wands. So your creative ideas are paying off for you. I feel like you're bringing a new zest to this company. You're bringing life to this company, new ideas, fresh ideas, constantly. I feel like you're updating an outdated system. Because with the Knight of Wands, that's like, usually it's seen as the player card, but I just feel like you're bringing fresh energy to the table. And people want to work with you. They want to give you a pay raise. They want, you could be a creative director, or you would be very good at doing so. You would be great on a movie set. I'm seeing like, cause this is giving 80s Stranger Things alien vibes here. You will be great at some like creative directing or just the type of person people go to for new fresh ideas. Clarifying the Emperor is the Hierophant. You have the Hierophant here twice. The Ace of Pentacles here twice. We have the Ten of Swords. The worst part of a situation is over. So if you were having any conflict with a boss or any conflict at work, it's over. Someone has been removed fired or and or this higher up is no longer feuding with you they're actually um they're putting you in their position giving their position to you or you're working beside this person you no longer have to fight for this position so i feel like for those of you who are dealing with some complications at the workplace that person has been removed or silenced and you are not in conflict anymore with the boss or anybody here they actually want to work with you. Clarifying the Hierophant is the devil, Capricorn. So you may have Capricorn highly aspected in your chart or Capricorn energy is just influencing you heavily right now when it comes to work. Two of Pentacles, yeah. They are. A, they see your work ethic and they just, they want you to sign a contract. They want you to stay. They see that with the little bit of time you've been at their company, everything has gone up. They're obsessed with you. They are obsessed with what you create. Everything, Everyone becomes obsessed with what you create. You're bringing in new customers, new repeated customers at that. Clarifying the Ace of Pentacles is Nine of Cups, wish fulfillment. You are going to get what you want. You want that pay raise, that job, that promotion, that status increase, money increase. You're going to get it. Justice, that's your karma justice. This is also Libra energy. That is your karma justice to get this job, to get this position, to work with these higher ups, to be a boss. That is your karma. Overall energy is the seven of cups. Yeah, so, and then we have the three of pentacles. So, ace and page of cups, someone you were working with tr is trying to be confusing on purpose. It could have been a Capricorn. There was a Capricorn at work or someone you were dating or sleeping with was purposefully confusing you. For some of you, it's a coworker. For some of you, it's someone you were sleeping with. They were purposefully throwing you off your game like they know that you were working for a promotion or to increase your money and status in some way shape or form and they would just slowly and slightly manipulate you like they know you're trying to work and focus and they'll like try to use sex to distract you flirt with you um bring you things little things they would disguise it as nice gestures but really it was to throw you off your square or try to intimidate you at work by giving you gossip. They'll just do slight little things to slightly turn you away or confuse you. I just feel like someone, they weren't outright screaming in your face and dancing around trying to distract you or anything, but it was just light little things that you would never notice. You know, with the overall energy being the seven of cups, confusion, manipulation, I feel like for some of you, you and your boss got off on the wrong foot, but it's been fixed. They understand you now. You understand each other now. I feel like um, you may have butted heads for some reason. Maybe they liked the way things were going. Maybe they felt like you were trying to take over the place. But either, regardless of what it was, you guys are great now. They love you. They love you working there. They want you to work beside them. They want to bring you into their circle. They want to work with you. And they want to give you that pay raise promotion. Whatever position or thing that you want, they're going to make sure you have it. I feel like you may be confused because it's going too well. No need to be confused. Everything is fine. Just, I'll just say don't get distracted. Work with your sexual energy, but put it into your work. I also feel like with the devil Capricorn clarifying the higher font and with the two of pentacles, make sure you have a work-life balance. Don't 
waste your creative energy too much on sex, but also don't put too much of your sexual energy into your work because you could drain yourself if you put if you go too extreme on either end. Yeah, with the Justice card balance. Cuz I feel like you could drain yourself too much when it comes to work or sex. So you got to find that balance. But don't we all? <laughs> all right. Um I'm going to leave it there. I send you peace, blessings, and love. Congratulations. Namaste.